quick video. I'm sitting here at home and I'm working on Trello. And uh, Trello is awesome. It is a great tool for real estate agents. So I just wanted to take a second and share a little bit about how I use Trello um, to be a virtual real estate agent. Um, so you're watching the virtual real estate agent with EXP and we're just gonna take a minute and show you how I do things, okay? So if you check it out, I have the Trello card, Trello app right here and I use it all the time. Um, let me go back to this. So the way Trello works is you're able to create boards. Think of like um, like a cork board where you can pin things up on the wall. Each of these represents a different board. And so I use to handle all my real estate transactions between me and our virtual assistant. Um, we use um, we use Trello. So you can go here. So and we have all of our transactions. So we have a new listings board for carry, pending board for buyers, and then we have listings. We have a pending board, or pending listings that I have, and pending buyers that we have. Okay, live listings, pending buyers for other clients. Then we have canceled listings. All of our closed files get moved over to this, sorry, to this board right here. So, and then we also have, I have a master transaction checklist that we use for the checklist within all of our boards. So let me show you just a quick example of how I use it. So I'm doing this transaction right now with uh, our transaction coordinator. So I have the closing date here at the top, the address. I have all of the contact information there for our clients. So it's easy to find, it's easy to recall and to use if, if I need it or I forgot it. Um, labels, the people that are a part of the transaction. And then I have a checklist here of all the things that we do um, before, during, and after the closing. Okay, And then we have comments. So we can add comments in here when something's done, if there's uh, something needs to be addressed, we put all the updates on this. So um, we have, for example, um, for this one, we have the inspection. So we have the inspection scheduled for Wednesday at 4 p.m. And I can put that in here. And now anybody that is subscribed to this board, my transaction coordinator, um, any uh, anybody else, myself, will get notified when something changes or a comment's posted in here. So it's really cool. Um, the other way I use this, and it's just an easy way to keep track of all of our transactions and notes. So when we're done, what we'll do actually, for example, I have Lafayette is uh, just closed. So we can actually hold down on this and you're able to drag this. So I'm going to drag this all the way over to the done section. And, uh, and there's a faster way to do this, but I wanted you to see how it actually can be picked up. Did I miss it? I think I missed it. Master transaction, close files. There we go. Okay, but you could go in the file and you can actually, uh, act. you can move it, move the card to whatever board you want it to be a part of. Um, the other way you, we use this is for training. Super cool. Um, you guys will see more of this in the future. Um, I'm going to be creating this whole training board where we actually, we, we are tracking all of our, everything that we do. For our throughout a transaction under contract buyers and then we're creating all of these green things represent um, a video that we've created that we've tagged to each of these files so now I can do all my training in here people can go and find out what do I need to do when I need to schedule a home inspection we go check it out oh, here's the video then there's the people that we call it's been uploaded. We have checklists for this. We do all of that 
in all of these um, different uh, boards to make the process easier. So guys, I highly recommend if you want to be a virtual real estate agent on the go, wherever you go, Trello is, and it's free. Trello is 100% free and you can use it on your phone, you can use it on your desktop, but I just wanted to shoot a quick video for you guys so you guys can get an idea of how I do it, what I do. If you have any specific questions on specific tasks that are happening, put a comment below. And if you guys like this video, subscribe. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot more of these uh, over the next couple months and continue to provide value. If there's something you want to see, you have questions about, put them in the comments below and I will look forward to doing some more videos for you guys. But other than that, that's all I had. Thanks guys and take care.